Okay, so it just stays stuck in here. It just stays st stuck on the screen over and over again. It does light up the all the lights and then it turns them off. And once it shows the regal screen, it doesn't pass beyond this. It is already on the screen for approximately 20 minutes now. Now, if I turn it on with a thumb drive that has an older version of the firmware that has the firmware inside if I turn it off and I connect the thumb drive with the firmware inside without doing any key sequence and turning it uh, and t turning the device on again it is going to boot pretty much instantly There you go. Okay. Now I can I can take the thumb drive out. I can work with the device. The device is going to work. Now, the next time I turn it off, it is kind of a hit or miss. It is really uncertain if the device is going to come right on without the thumb drive. Okay. With any anything's connected to it. Not even the not even the thumb drive. Okay. So now it is booting. Let's try again. now boot it again okay so it is it happens a lot of times but then if i turn it off and i turn it on right on and usually it boots again but if i turn it off even if i let it boot and if i turn it off for 10 minutes 15 minutes one hour two hours well if i turn it off uh, and especially especially if i unplug the if i unplug the 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 power cable especially if i unplug the the power cable most likely it, it is going to happen again but the the point is the next time or if if i turn it off because i'm not using it the next time i'm gonna use it or i need to use it it will most likely become stuck again on that screen and then i have to boot it with a thumb drive with the firmware inside i did everything i did the key sequence regal told me oh now it is booting again so it is after a while of being turned off it doesn't boot anymore i even did the, the key sequence with the thumb drive and the firmware i did the key sequence of pressing the help button over and over again that regal the regal told to me i did all of that and it, it keeps doing that Okay, so once it works, it works, and it is going to boot most of the times. But after, uh, after I turn it off, or if I turn it off after a while, when I did, uh, when I need to work with it again, I have, I have to have the thumb drive connected to the USB port in order to the device to boot properly. So, yeah.